Hi there, everyone. Nice to have you along with us once again. We're at the Riverside Stadium. Martin Tyler along with Alan Smith providing the commentary for you today. The match has so much potential and kickoff is just moments away. Middlesbrough against Manchester United. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Looking forward to this. We've got some really good players out there and importantly, we've got some match winners, some goal scorers down on that pitch. And I don't think we'll be disappointed. And this is the 11 that will take the field for Middlesbrough. Different kind of approach from this side, I think. They will get men behind the ball. They will make it difficult for the opposition to score. It's that old-fashioned art that's quite often ignored of defending, of uh, just resolutely sitting in there and seeing what you can get on the break. This is then the Manchester United lineup. Ben Leno starts in goal. Luke Shaw starts with Joel Matip as the centre backs. Wilfried Zaha starts alongside Ryan Fraser in midfield. And they've got plenty of goal threat with two strikers in the attack. Thank you. Enjoy the game. United, the Red Devils, the last team playing in red to win the league the Premier League it's been a, a blue division five consecutive seasons so maybe time for red to flex its muscles again yeah and if City lifting the Premier League trophy doesn't fire them up nothing will it's about uh, really regaining that hunger and that work ethic that quality to get themselves back up to the top again well it's a uh, Pretty robust start to the game. It's certainly a foul, but the referee's kept his cards in his pocket. <laughs> kept his concentration, the goalkeeper, and because of that, kept hold of the ball. Yeah, he seems to fill the goal, this lad. He's quite an imposing keeper. Clayton. And it's Fletcher. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Cleared the ball. Lindelof. Here's Iosi Perez. It's with De Bruyne. Gabriel Jesus. Fraser. Could get his cross in now. Well, he clears the danger. And it's Fletcher. Here's McNair. Manchester United have won the ball back here. Now De Bruyne. Lindelof. De Bruyne. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. Wonderful finish. It's no goal. The flag's up. But it's certainly a, a well-worked move, but uh, denied by the assistant. Well, we can see it again, Alan. Well, it's so difficult, these decisions by the assistants, but I think he's got that one right. Well played. Adam Clayton. Clayton. Here's McNair probing away, working away at the opposition with these passes. He's going to try his luck. Good save by the keeper. Well, they've got the opposition on the back foot with this break. They're coming at them with numbers. That is a decent tackle. Now Zaha. Opportunity in a wider area. Zaha has to get it into the box. Reaching for it a little bit with the header, and that's the expected result. Back to the training ground, I think.
Gabriel Jesus. Turn pass. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Set up to play on the break now. He's gone in with the header. But the ball nowhere near going into the net. I think it's come off the top of his head, that one. Now Diego Rico. Now De Bruyne. He's got skill with the ball. Backing himself in these circumstances. Well, it's easy here for the keeper. with an interception now Zaha yeah, look at that possession it has been a cagey affair so far but quite often in these kind of matters it does open up as the game goes on will that be the case here Lindelof Fraser trying to get involved I think the forward by coming this deep to get on the ball and it's a break led here by De Bruyne well for Zaha Fredericks game still level but the pressure might be counting and it's Fletcher now Paddy McNair Iose Perez. Incisive pass. And he's confident with the ball at his feet, isn't he? There's a cut back off. Outstanding save. A full tilt. But well, he's a big lad and he needed every inch of his height there. Corner is a short one this time. Turned aside there by the keeper. The referee has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes of added time. Now Diego Rico. Gabriel Jesus. Cross is blocked here. De Bruyne's delivery. So it's half time and we're still waiting for that first goal. And setting the ball rolling for the second half, Manchester United. Fraser. Now they can switch the play here. It's good work here in terms of possession. Can they find the final pass? And the defender is able here to control the ball and clear. Here's McNair. Clayton. Fletcher. Now De Bruyne. Diego Rico. Fraser we're looking for a couple of killer passes here from the attacking team against defenders that are really earning their money the whole team is defending Gabriel Jesus Gabriel Jesus the chance did open up for that kind of shot well if you don't have a go Substitution now for the home team. That 
looked very good indeed, but the move is broken down. It'll be a throw. It's going to make a change, and it's clearly a tactical one. There doesn't seem to be any injury involved. Fraser. Waiting in the middle, Gabriel Jesus. Not a great cross, really, for the goalkeeper. An easy piece of work. I think we've seen it. The visitors controlling possession. But I've been a bit cleverly done. Put away by Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, nothing wrong with that, is there? He has developed into one of the world's very best players, this boy. It's a good performance from a very good team. A team that we expected to be better than the opposition. That's the way it's panning out so far. Yeah, you'd expect them to ease away from the opposition in this match. Can't see any shocks in it. I can't really. Manchester United in front, as Manchester predicted, United really. Goal, number 17, Kevin De Bruyne. It's good play to uh, get a foot in and intercept. Manchester United want to make a change now. Fredericks. De Bruyne. Here's Iosi Perez. It's an advantage for Manchester United. Play on, says the ref. Two substitutions to come, one from each camp. He's normally good from these set plays, and uh, his teammates are expecting a good ball in. Goalkeeper has to go and uh, get the ball for the goal kick. Another look, Alan, at De Bruyne's goal. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Well, they look promising there in that wide area, but the defender's done well. Oh, listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans certainly doing the bits to spur their team on for an equaliser. Good position for the cross. Morrison. Leno makes the save without any difficulty. Johnny Housen. A substitution, and it's Manchester United to make it. Morrison. Moving it nicely and productively here. Golden opportunity now. And that's dealt with easily by Leno. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. And that will be a goal kick. Excellent performance from the forward. He's been taken off now. And he's been right on his game, Alan, hasn't he? Oh, hasn't he just? And he's combined well with his teammates. And when he's had to, he's held it up. Let them support and really done all aspects of his job. Granovelt. That's good vision to see the pass. Good interception. Well, the atmosphere is improving now. Now the home team need to improve. They're still in with a shout. Yeah, time is running out. It's now or never. I think they've got to lift the game. Encouraging play. Real chance. Leno makes the save without any difficulty. Counting down in the last ten minutes here. Nine to go. Now Diego Rico. Now De Bruyne. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. clock and uh, the other on the match because uh, there's just that one goal in it but it's a goal to the good five minutes left just a bit lax in possession Morrison Ryan Schotten Lindelof. Yeah, 
Gabriel Jesus. The referee has indicated there will be a minute of three minutes of added time. Good reading of the by anticipating the pass. Gabriel Jesus tries to shot here. The shot gets blocked. It's a good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. And it's come to an end here with the final whistle.